Hello everyone and welcome to Gamens. Today we're back with a video. We're going to be opening up Hidden Arsenal's Chapter 1. They get some of them beautiful parallel rare cards. We'll also be doing a giveaway. Um, one lucky subscriber who happens to comment down below what their favourite card from this particular set will win one full box. So they'll get one of these for themselves to open, which is pretty good. So like, comment and subscribe to see more of our stuff uh we recently haven't been putting any videos out because i recently set my fat ass on my laptop so i'm using a windows machine now so i'm going to try premiere pro so that's why i'm not using the face cam i'm just going to try and learn the basics of just edit this video get it up and we'll see where we go from there so we'll begin the video i'll set this this down here we'll we'll start with this one here i hope i've got the right angles here here we go. So we've got we've got into this one. I'll probably cut that out. And what is this? You get some. Oh, I it must be just telling you how to play a deck. I'm not going to waste some time looking at that. But you get one of seven secrets in here, and I've got the Trishula dice. I'm pretty happy about that. Trishula's pretty good, and that must be the secret card there. So we'll open this up here. Get our packs here. Oh, where's the card? Oh, here we go. We've got Pile Armed Dragon. It's actually pretty cool looking. Um, I'll have to check out his effect afterwards. So we'll set him here. That's the that's our first promo. I'm, I'm glad that it's secret promos. My friend sent me a picture of this and I thought the promo card was jumbo size for some reason. But here we go. Here's the Trish of the Dice. It can sit there. And let's begin with the first pack. Cards that I sort of would want to get out of this would be probably DT, Dark Magician, Blue Eyes, stuff like that. So this is a, oh, I see it at the back. It's got Queromancer of the Ice Barrier, Medium of the Ice Barrier, Secret Guard of the Ice Barrier, Flamveil, oh, oh, Magician, I thought that was the exact same card there. Ally Justice Cycle Reader, General Ice Barrier card. And that's our first, um, what is it, Parallel Rare? Is that what they're called? I don't know. They look pretty good. Pretty nice. I know Skildrain's one of these, so it's, it's pretty nice, because Skildrain recently went back to three on the ban list, so it's nice. So this is the, I assume this is the Ultra Rare one. It really shines. That's actually lovely. It's really nice looking. What is that? We've got Material Exterior. That's pretty, that's... Pretty good uh, parallel rare card, I suppose. Is this is this ultra? It is ultra. I f I could have sworn it was one ultra per pack, but it must be. And polymerization. That looks amazing. Look at it shine. Pretty nice. And so so that's it. So I could have sworn it said something about colored text, but. I could be wrong. It, it just appeared to be gold as, as ultra. But they, they, they actually really do shine. Look at the, the polymerization is just still shining there in the back. And you get a, a standard one. You can sit there. I, I don't really know anything about it. I'm just going to flick through these ones. I've still got another one to open. I really don't want this video to be that long because, as I said, I'll be learning Premiere Pro. The Adobe software just to see how things work. On my Mac I had Final Cut, which was pretty pretty easy to use. General, more Ice Buyer stuff. Shock Trooper. My justice. Fanville Baby. Wow. Element of Hero Stratos. Oh no, he's not. I know he can be sort of parallel. I was sort of hoping this Stratos would be nice and parallel, but nope. We have Detonate, which was in Brothers of Legend? I don't know if it was an exclusive card there, but that's our first one. That's not not really that good. We've got Ally of Justice Decisive Armor. I assume this is what the, the Necros monster Decisive Armor is wearing, which makes sense because it's sort of strapped its back. We've got Interior Barkeon. It is very nice. Very nice indeed. And we have Lava Golem. Whoa! They, they have really... This, this looks amazing. This is a beautiful, beautiful card. I, w I would actually... Oh, it's like it's like it's made of glass and it's just shining. Unbelievable. 
Okay, we'll put the promo down here. Kabakion. That's probably my favourite pull so far. It's so nice looking. It really goes all over the card. There is its friends. Look at the sparkle of that polymerization. It's really going off there. We'll set you beside the polymerization just to really show. Oh, beautiful. So, so far with this one, I'm, I'm pretty happy. That was some pretty good pulls. Lava Golem is a good competitive card. Um, it's just for them decks that want to summon a ton of monsters and you don't really want them to summon a ton of monsters. But all in all, these are actually quite cheap. Um, they were, they're sort of £10, which isn't too bad for the cards you're getting inside. I, would, I don't know too much if there is any pricey cards. But we'll do the same as this one. Oh, we've got Trish dice again. I'm actually glad they the went out of the way to hide the dice because I think the, the previous one you could sort of tell what dice was in the box. But we've got another, we've got another Trish one. Don't know if that is a good dice or not. I assume it's pretty common. So you can sit there, Trish dice. We'll get our two packs out. Let's see if we can't get another... Oh, see wind. I think I've actually got the exact same promo. Oh no, it's another armed dragon. Armed dragon. Get in focus. Stop focusing on him. Yeah, there we go. Armed dragon, the armored dragon. Nice. We've got two armed dragons. We've got two packs left. Remember to tell us below your favorite card from this special set. Um, to be in for a chance to win one for yourself. I mean... It's free cards, and all we ask is that you tell us your favorite card inside. Wait a minute, he was, that's actually a pretty good card. That's a good reprint. I don't know if it's feasible now. We've got Harbor Lady 3. Not so, the, the ordinary parallel rares don't seem to be that, that good. Like so far, I've got that Nate, a nice buyer card and Harbor Lady. Let's see what we get next. Oh, we got Red Eyes, Black Dragon. That is amazing. I wish I'd have used the, what is it, the, the OG artwork from the structure deck. That's pretty nice, but, I mean, the red, that looks ni nice as well. What's that you beside this polymerization? Mystical Space Typhoon, like, that is amazing. Spells seem to really show off how parallel rare, or whatever you would call it. Unbelievable. Looks amazing. And we have a blue eyes white dragon as well. Nice. Oh, look at that. It is top of the blue eyes. It's not the best artwork, but I mean, it, it still looks really nice as this foilie. Look at that. It's so shiny. So, so shiny. You sit there. I have no sort of structure to this. Let's have a look at them. Look at that polymerization. Still shining in the background. And then there's the... Or detonate. Oh, wow. I assume all the common cards could be the parallel rare sort of thing since detonate is over there as a parallel rare and I just pulled one as a common so nice we're down to our last booster pack hopefully we can get dark magician in here I was actually saying to myself um I'll buy the two I'll buy the third one for the giveaway and I'll I'll probably not open it again but these cards look amazing I'm probably going to go online and buy a few more of the hidden arsenals chapter one just just to open them because the cards look amazing. Buster Blader, Stratos, Ice Barrier, Ice Barrier, Ice Barrier. I assume all these Ice Barriers were probably in somewhere in the structure deck. We've got Night of Sealand as our first, oh, we've, let's get their first parallel. Can't really see it unless it's Ultra for some reason. Like it's sort of hard to tell, but we've got Night of Sealand, which, um, what is it? Is this a, a goat card? It's a, a card that's seen playing Go format. It's badly miscut actually, but it still does look amazing. Like look at him, he's just it's just all parallel rarish. Uh, our next one is Oh another lava golem. I'm actually happy about that because this is one this is definitely what I would play. I sort of need lava golems from Elite Stack, so I actually would play these over the secrets. They just look so nice. Like look at the sparkly of this angry gentleman with the opponent in a cage. Beautiful. And the last but not least, we have a Barrel Dragon. Quite nice. Quite, quite nice. So we've hit the... Oh, I'll set you over here. I'll do a recap on these because I really want to show off the shine because the, 
It's so, I'm sure people have seen pictures online, but it doesn't do it justice, but seeing a moving image sort of does. This is the last of the common bulk. And we'll look at all these beautiful cards. In no particular order. So we've got the Nacheria Cherries. Looks amazing. Really, really shiny. Lava Golem, which looks amazing. It's just, it's just, it's so nice. Another Lava Golem. Naturia Barkeon, which is nice. It's pretty nice. Allied of Justice Decisive Armor. Looks nice as well. Polymerization, which just, it's, it's, it's just extra shiny, it seems. It's just, it's so sparkly. Like, look at that. It's amazing. It's just, it seems to be spells seem to show up better. Because you see Ball Dragon here, he's he's sort of sparkly, but he's not as sparkly. Knight Assailant is a beautiful card. It's nice as well. Blue Eyes, White Dragon. Very nice. Red Eyes, which, nice. Mystical Space Typhoon, as I said, spell, it's really, it's really showing off its shine. It looks amazing. And last but not least, Naturia Exterior. Good for your Awaken the Dragon target. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe so we can keep making more Yu-Gi-Oh! content. And it motivates us to create more videos and let us know what we're doing right and what we're doing wrong. Yada, yada, yada. Don't forget about the giveaway. Comment down below your favourite card from Hidden Arsenal's Chapter 1.